Hi, this is Abby Rogers with Dry Steam. In this video, I'm going to walk through everything you need to have on hand and know in advance for a smooth installation of the XT Series or XTR electrode steam humidifier. Let's start with the tools and supplies you will need. Basic hand tools, open end and box wrenches, a set of nut drivers or a drill with driver bits, mounting hardware, field supplied piping, field supplied wiring, control screwdrivers for landing control wiring on VaporLogic board, VaporLogic IOM, and of course the XT series or XTR IOM. Now we'll walk through the components and connection points you'll be working with during installation. Field wiring according to the IOM and wire diagrams, proper grounding and approved earth ground field provided, steam hose, tubing, or piping to dispersion, supply water and drain piping, demand signal, transmitter, humidistat, VDC or milliamps or back net control and monitoring, airflow proving switch, and duct high limit. Before you head out to the installation site, here are some things you should verify. Installation location for the unit is clear and ready, Power, water, and drain have been run and are operational. Code approved electrical disconnect. Proper clearances per IOM. Current firmware version on USB stick. And that you have ethernet cable and a laptop in case you need a direct connection to the VaporLogic controller board. Installation of the XT or XTR series humidifier can vary, depending upon if wall space, power, water, and drain are ready to go. Once installed, startup time may vary depending on the application and system size. Now you have all the information you need to properly prepare for a smooth installation of the XT series or XTR electrode steam humidifier. Taking time to plan and check ahead of installation day will save time in the field and prevent unnecessary return trips.